The Redberry Lake Biosphere Reserve established 2000 is a UNESCO biosphere reserve covering 112,200 hectares (433 square miles) in the province of Saskatchewan, southwest Canada. The regional landscape is composed of rolling prairie dotted with seasonal ponds and marshes along with aspen, shrub groves. The core area is Redberry Lake, a saline lake with several islands. There are small patches of natural mixed prairie which are very rare in this highly grazed and cultivated part of the prairies. <coughs> Ecological characteristics Redberry Lake is a closed basin in which water entering the lake does not pass out through downstream flows. The lake itself is a large kettle hole characterized by a central flat bottom. Gently shelving underwater slopes occur above depths of approximately 25 meters feet. Water is shallowest in the southwest, southeast and northeast areas, and around the islands. Major habitats and land cover types include typical prairie grasses such as wheatgrass, fescue, oatgrass and sedges, forest dominated by aspen with shrubs such as rasp, silver willow and hawthorn, a saline lake with rocky islands, farmland cultivated with wheat and barley, and pasture land. The reserve provides habitats for nine endangered, threatened or rare bird species, as well as over 180 other species including the white-winged scoter Melanita fusca, California gull Laris californicus, ring-billed gull Laris delawensis, and piping plovers Caradrius melodus. A key research activity undertaken in the area is monitoring of American white pelican Pelicanus erythrorhynchos nesting sites. Topic: <laughs> Socioeconomic characteristics. As of 2006, fewer than 1,000 people live in the area most of whom are Euro-Canadians, primarily of Ukrainian origin. The main economic activities in the region are agriculture and livestock raising. Ecotourism development over the past decades has encouraged new ways of looking at local habitats and brought new hope to some community enterprises. The expansion of sustainable tourism activities in tandem with wildlife protection is supported by a vast majority of stakeholders, including representatives of the local communities. The protected status of the site prevents tourism from intruding into fragile areas and allows tourist numbers to be kept at sustainable levels. New sustainable models of agriculture are being adopted, including grazing management in prairies ecosystems, and there exists strong potential for the development of new sustainable agriculture, livestock, and silviculture products that could be marketed under the Biosphere Reserve brand. There is also potential for linkages with other biosphere reserves to market products from sustainable resource use, and to educate the general public about conservation practices. The reserve is administered by the Redberry Regional Economic Development Authority Corporation, Rural Municipalities of Redberry, Douglas, Meeting Lake, and Great Bend, Lucky Man First Nations Reserve, and Hafford, Saskatchewan. topic area The reserve's surface area is 112,200 hectares, 433 square miles. The core area is 5,600 hectares, 22 square miles, surrounded by buffer zones of 6,300 hectares, 24 square miles, and transition areas of 100,300 hectares, 387 square miles. Topic: Sources. This article incorporates text from a free content work.
License Statement, UNESCO, MAB Biosphere Reserves Directory, UNESCO, UNESCO. To learn how to add open license text to Wikipedia articles, please see this how-to page. For information on reusing text from Wikipedia, please see the terms of use. <laughs>